we had an interesting comment on our uh, one of our Facebook live videos. We were talking about somebody who was in this minor fender bender and was being sued for like over a million dollars. And this whole issue had been dragging on for over three years. You know, and it's one of these accidents where there was no fault uh, and no documented injuries, but you know, someone is seeing their opportunity to make a grab for some cash, so they're doing it. You know, they're saying their lives ruined from this fender bender. And anyway, the comment we got was that a lot of this litigation that goes on wouldn't happen if it were not for the insurance or the, the high amount of insurance this person had. So it was good that this person I spoke with had the insurance to cover the claim. But on the other hand, if that insurance wasn't there, there wouldn't be a claim in the first place. So. You know, you're being sued for a million dollars because you have a million dollar policy. Whereas if you had a $250,000 auto policy, you'd be sued for 250000 right? The attorney who's suing you wants to get the easiest money they can. And if they had made a more reasonable claim, not seven figures, it would have been settled years ago and everybody would have gone on their way. But the fact that there was a seven-figure insurance policy, the attorney who is doing the suing is trying to get more money, and since the whole claim is ridiculous in the first place, the insurance company doesn't want to pay out. So this whole dispute has dragged on for years now. So, you know, it, it, it goes along with the idea of, with insurance, one, you can't just buy more insurance. I know a lot of people wrongly advise people, just buy more insurance, because there's a lot of things that insurance don't, doesn't cover, and that's certainly your plan A, but if you don't have a plan B, then you're gonna be screwed if, if your insurance won't cover the claim. And then so on the second part of that insurance thing is, if you have too much insurance, or I guess if you have insurance at all, you could encourage litigation. People could come after you because of the insurance, and maybe you're not gonna be out of pocket because you had that policy, but uh, there's an emotional toll that comes with being involved in a lawsuit when somebody sues you, and you know, you're telling your friends and family, the first thing they're going to ask is, you know, what'd you do wrong, uh, you know? Why did you do that? Who did you hurt? Uh, you know, are you going to prison? Uh, everybody just assumes that if you've been named in this lawsuit that you've done something wrong when that isn't the case. So, um, anyway, that's that's my rant about insurance. Uh, if you don't have some, definitely got some. But it should not be the entire strategy and tactic that you have for protecting your assets. If you are interested in having more of a strategy, please go to livemorecarefree.com, schedule some time to speak with me, and thank you for watching.